Hi, in this video I'm going to walk you through how to use Microsoft Word's Format Painter. The Format Painter is a quick and easy tool to copy formatting from one selection to another. The Format Painter copies text formatting from the text you have selected and applies it to other text within your document. It can copy font, font size, line spacing, indents, bullets, styles, and other formatting features. It can copy just the text, and you can also copy paragraph formatting. When using the Format Painter, you can use it in a single instance or in multiple instances at once. So to get started, I'm going to switch over to my practice document. To start with, let me show you the different ways that you can access the Format Painter. The first way is from the Home tab, Clipboard Group, you've got your Format Painter. Another way, if you use it a lot, is you can add it to your Quick Access Toolbar. To do that, we're just going to right-click on it and tell it to add to the Quick Access Toolbar. When it does that, it adds the paintbrush up to your Quick Access Toolbar. You can also right-click within your document and access the Format Painter. And there are shortcut keys for it. Once you've selected the text that you want to take your formatting from, Control-Shift-C will copy the formatting, and Control-Shift-V will paste it wherever you put your cursor. Now, if I'm going to be doing a lot of format painting within my document, and especially if my document has a lot of styles in it, what I like to do is turn on my paragraph markers and also my styles pane, just to make sure I'm staying consistent with my styles in my document. To turn on your paragraph markers, what you do is you come up to the Home tab, Paragraph Group, and you've got a toggle for that. Click once to turn it on, click again and it will turn it off. To turn on my Styles pane, again from the Home tab, Styles group, and the Styles dialog box. Click on it and it will add the styles to your side. And that way when I'm taking paragraph formatting and pasting it elsewhere, I can make sure that I'm not copying over a styles formatting and things like that. So now I'll show you how to paste formatting from one word to another word within the same paragraph. Okay, there's a couple different ways you can do it. You can click within the word that you want to take the formatting for. Click once on Format Painter if you only want to do it one time, and you notice it makes it gray and it does the same thing up here on my Quick Access Toolbar. And then I click within the other word that I want to paint the formatting. If I want to do it multiple times within the paragraph, click the word I want to take it from, Double click on Format Painter, and now you can see my cursor has changed to a paintbrush. Now I can click on other words within the document, and it will change it. That's how you do it within the same paragraph. Hit the Escape key when you're done using the Format Painter, and you're back to your regular cursor, and you can see it has turned it off. Now if I want to take the formatting from a word within one paragraph and put it on words in another paragraph, what I can do is highlight the word or a section of the word, grab my Format Painter, and then I can click on the words within that paragraph that I want to move it to and add my formatting. Hit the Escape key to release it. Now the reason I couldn't just click on the word like I had done when I was doing it within the same paragraph is because when you do that and you go to another paragraph, Microsoft takes that as a you want to take the formatting for the paragraph and apply it. So for instance, I click on this word, click my Format Painter, and I come down here and click, it takes it and applies it to the whole paragraph. I'm going to undo that. If I had just clicked within the word up here and clicked Format Painter, then I would want to highlight the word to tell it no, only take it and put it where I want it. Okay. And you can do it with multiple words as well. So if I wanted to take this format and paint it elsewhere, I can highlight whatever I want. Okay? So please keep in mind when you're pasting between paragraphs. If you're pasting just the font formatting, select the whole word or part of the word. Then do your formatting. Then when you go to your next paragraph, all you need to do is click on the word and it will do it. Otherwise, if I just click in the word I want to take the formatting from and do my Format Painter, then I need to select the whole word of where I want to paste it, or whole words of where I want to paste it, to get it. 
this becomes very important when you have documents with um, styles in them. If you are pasting from one paragraph to another and you inadvertently paint the paragraph formatting, you can see we're changing the styles over here. So if I go back, this is a heading two. And when I pasted it, it switched it to a heading three. So if you're working with styles, please be very careful. And that's the reason I have my styles bar open on the side so that I can always see as I'm painting formatting what is changing. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to use the Format Painter on um, graphics. So for instance, in here, I've got my Find and Replace image with a large frame around it. And if I wanna do the same thing to my image down here, instead of having to go in and pick it, I can just select this image, come to my Format Painter, and paste it down here. Now you'll notice it did not change the size of my image. That's because the Format Painter does not change the size of images. So that's a very quick walkthrough of how to use the um, Format Painter. If you have any questions, please leave me comments below. Or if there's any other topics that you'd like me to go over, please let me know. Thank you.